the day of love, when everything seems to be turning into twos, everywhere you pass, people are coupling up. But, good, sheep, everyone seems to be coupling up. How are you celebrating your birthday? My dear brother and sister, have you been blessed with some nice flowers or you've had a taste of some nice, rich Ghanaian chocolate? Or, thank you two cities, and I'm two cities, pure water one city. Nation committee. Well, well, well. Welcome to Saints No Day Ground. Today is no ordinary Sunday. Today is Val's Day, which is what we are doing this thing proper and proper. Alright, so this week, this is what we are talking about. How did we get it this wrong? The originators of Valentine's Day celebrated it in a particular way, showing love to just about anybody. But how did it end up being sex? the icing on the cake that now vast day seems to be all about sex that is what we're talking about this week it is harsh it is hard but that's what we do so it's not the ground don't go anywhere stay tuned this a lovely day welcome back welcome back today it's going to be one of the shortest episodes ever you know what because i've got a date and i can't keep her waiting so ladies and gentlemen buckle up let's have the first ride okay don't worry okay uh, this is a snowy ground i'm going to be here start the rb uh, today is valentine so we are all going to get laughed up but where did we get it wrong at what point did we get it so wrong or are we better doing it right you know valentine started in a particular way showing love to just about anybody everybody everywhere that's how it started okay the less privilege now it gradually developed to the point where you do it to those that are close to you those that you know, those that you have some sort of relationship with, then gradually, gradually, we got to the point where it is mostly between a boyfriend or a girlfriend, a husband and a wife, or yeah, something like that. Those that are planning to do something together. That is the point where it got to. But at what point did sex become the icing on the cake? Valentine's Day. That is what I'm asking today. You know, it's been a question that keeps coming up every year, every year, every year. It keeps coming up. You can't run away from it. Says no day ground. Okay. So the question is, at what point did it get so wrong? Or at what point did we get it so wrong? Or are we the ones doing it right? Okay. Why is Valentine's Day now swimming? the pool of sex. I've been monitoring the conversation on social media, on Twitter, on Facebook, Instagram, they are mostly on Twitter because that's where most of the action is, mostly on Twitter. I've been monitoring the conversations from different groups, different platforms, different handles and it all seems to go around sex today. Yes, there have been numerous posts of the CEO. Today, somebody is going to suffer. Today, somebody's daughter is going to be crucified. Somebody's son is going to do this. Somebody, I tell you, you know, it, it's a two way thing. Ladies are doing it, guys are doing it. Some ladies would go, yes, I've prepared myself for tonight. Yes, I've prepared myself with different styles for tonight. A guy would be like, yes, my food, you know, can you change your brain? Charlie, it's all about that. Okay. So, how did we get it so wrong that something that is supposed to be Love like that has now become something that if you don't have a partner, if you don't have a, somebody you are in an intimate relationship with, you can't celebrate Valentine. That's how it has become. Okay, hence gnashing of flowery in our episode. That's, that's how it is now for us. Okay, that is how it has become for us, and this is quite unfortunate for so many grounds so i'm going to take it one by one to see 
how we got to this point. You know, in the previous episode, I said that when you put so much emphasis, when you put so much emphasis on on gifts, okay, especially during Valentine, the other party is now pushed to expect something in return, whether you like it or not. Okay, previously. Valentine's Day gifts were given out wholeheartedly without any intention of getting anything back. But since you know, your bum on has an off, but the answer is not watch how I can say and I watch who could see, but the answer is in the deal. Them, they are you know. Okay, now that is how the Valentine's Day, you know, uh, fill up is going now. So if you're a lady, if you're a guy, or mostly ladies, if you put so much emphasis on, I want something on birthday, I want something on birthday, this guy has to go through trouble to get you this thing that you want on birthday. Most often than not, he's also tempted to get something in return, or he's looking forward to get something in return. And in most situations, ladies do not buy something back or give something material to the person or to the boyfriend or to the husband or to the fiance that you're dealing with okay because if i get you chocolate what prevents you from also getting me chocolate or if i get you a nice dress nothing prevents you from getting me some nice shoes if i get you some b at least you should also get me something okay but i get you a now, what I look forward to is getting in bed with you. And that is how some ladies are also taking it. That once as an album is, yes, this evening, I will show you love. Yes, love. I will show you hot love. Why must it be hot? Why must it get to that point? And on many grounds, on many grounds, see, destiny is huge. Right? You know, if you, you can argue that that is somebody's way of showing love. Okay, that is somebody's way of showing, expressing love. But is it the best way? Okay. You owe your opinions, you owe your actions, you, 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 you own everything it is that you're doing. I can force you to change it since the new brand has no maturity to force you to change it. But if you go, you are done, guys. It will happen. It will happen. Tell it, things are going on. You see the teddy bears flying from here to there. You see chocolate from here to there. And it is funny, some stories that are coming up. Like it. And the guy actually got chocolate, six cities for the girlfriend. But how to pay delivery fee? 25 cities to get it delivered. In fee, so sure, next time, uh, what do you expect? <coughs> it don't happen. It will happen. It will happen. Bob, Bob the scenario. Uh-huh. So, see, how we got to this point is, is something that, uh, let, let, let me give you a simple, or basic example. If you get 10 people lined up, okay, Tell you whisper something to the ears of the first one and ask him or her to you know take the message down the line, whisper to the next person, the next person whispers to the next person like that continuously. The narrative will change by the time it gets to the last person. Okay, so Valentine came in a particular way, but gradually over the years it has been perverted to a particular way that is not good. Now, spiritualists or religious leaders will tell you that today a lot of souls are going to be trapped here and there, both male, both females. A lot of destinies are going to be at risk. That is from their religious point of view that I have no power to dissect because the Spirit of the Lord is in control in that level, okay, or on that level. That is, is that is one story that we'll get into it once we get somebody to help us get into it. But for now, on our level, on the level of Sun Snake is on Snake Ground, on the level of us, okay, on our level, on our level, on all ground, see how we turned Valentine's Day into 
the sex is one thing that we can't understand. We can only try to understand, but we can't understand any way, anyhow. We only hope that as days go by, people are going to realize that you know, sharing love is not only based on sex. You know, today it's going to be an ultimatum in most cities, in most relationships, that sex will have to happen else a relationship is going to die but if you're going to base your relationship on sex or if you're going to base how much you love a person on her, his or her ability to have sex with you on this day then that is not love that is some messed up relationship you are in right if somebody truly loves you it's not going to be because of sex if somebody truly loves you it's not going to be based on whether or not yourself to the person some the one that loves you should actually be happy that you are not giving yourself to him or to her right but preserving it for him that on that day and finally get married it's going to happen right like i said you own your actions you have the right to do what it is that you want but see you watch out since the ground we they give you every day anytime welcome once again to today of love my name is mc haymaker it was great doing this with you now it's time bing 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 it's time i'm out